where we see all of these relationships between underlying metabolism being a key factor contributing to mental health status. And the application of the, this unique diet, which we know increases ketone bodies, which appear to have direct impacts on the brain, now seems to be linked to improved serious mental illness. And it'll be interesting to see where the, that evolves, but it's just a fascinating world to imagine that nutrition, not a medication, not a technology, but the, the simply going to the grocery store and swapping the things you choose in there can lead to these powerful, powerful therapeutic effects um, in people of all sorts of different conditions uh, or disorders. On one of the studies that I read about the administration of exogenous ketones and the impact it has on brain network stability was from 2020, where they investigated if brain network stability responds to two major brain fuels, either glucose or ketones. And participants came to the laboratory on two occasions and drank exogenous ketones or glucose. And after cons consuming these drinks, they underwent an MRI scan. Strikingly, the study showed that ketones increased the stability of brain networks. In contrast, glucose decreased the stability of the network.